Hi, this is Erica for GM Retro, and today I'm going to be doing a review on the Sega Genesis Ultimate Portable Games Player by AT Games. Okay, so let's open it up and see what we get. So inside there is the user manual. An ad for one of their other products. The USB charger. And then the unit itself. Okay, so let's go over some of the specs. So here is the SD slot, and this allows you to add more games to the unit off of your computer. And then there is an AV out, and this allows you to play the unit on a TV. The AV cord doesn't come with the unit, but any AV cord will work as long as the male headphone connector to female RCA connectors. There's also a lithium ion battery in here, and there's four to six hours gameplay depending on the volume. On the bottom here is the on and off switch and on the top is the volume and here is the USB charger port and on the bottom here is the headphone jack. So let's take a look at the button layout. The layout is similar to the Genesis 6 button controllers but is downsized to fit on the unit. And the D-pad is nice and smooth and very responsive and the buttons work well. I just find that the buttons are a little bit close together but spacing them further would require a large console and all the controls work well and are in the right places. So the start and pause button is located here on the top right and the menu button is over here on the top left. So the unit is actually a really nice size because it can easily fit into my purse so it's great for going away and it's pretty light coming in at 0.26 pounds. Okay, so I have the lights turned off because we're going to take a look at the screen. So I don't know how well you can see on camera, but the screen's actually very vivid and is the correct resolution for the Sega Genesis. And there's no stretching or squeezing of the image. And the unit itself comes with 40 preloaded Sega titles, which I'll include a list of in the description. And there's also 40 additional titles, and these include simple memory games, card games, games like Snake, Sudoku, and many more. So the menus are really easy to navigate. You just use the D-pad and scroll through and once you've found one that you want to play you just use the start button up in the right hand corner. So there's many famous titles that are preloaded, and I'll put them in the description later. And I just wanted to add in that the sound's not bad. Everything is really clear with no interference. The only thing is there's only one speaker on the unit so unfortunately there's no stereo sound. So to sum it up, I'm going to take a look at the pros and the cons of the AT Games Sega Genesis Ultimate Portable Game Player. Pros, the ability to add games using an SD card. So technically you could have your entire Sega Genesis library on this tiny unit. It has a vibrant screen, really good build quality, a good selection of games, a really responsive D-pad, and above average sound. For cons, I would have liked to see them somehow make the buttons a little larger or more spaced apart, and I would have liked to see an AV cable included in the box, but they're quite common and only worth a few bucks, so getting one won't be a problem. The AT Game Sega Genesis Ultimate Game Player is available at our online retro gaming store at www.gmretro.com. We carry many other items and are updating all the time. We also have reviews of our products in text format on the site with photos of the items that I've reviewed. I'll put up a link in the description. Thanks for watching.